The RBCT program provides the Army the ability to allow airmen as well as infantry soldiers the ability to train together. Varia was selected as part of the initial production configuration for the RBCT, primarily because of its blend of technology and its ability to provide a mixed reality solution with high resolution visuals that enabled us to meet the specific demanding requirements. They are manufactured in a TAA compliant environment and they don't emit any kind of radio frequencies, which would make them inappropriate to use in a, a high secure environment. For the Army, we have a, a number of different uh, HMDs uh, using XR and VR. So we use them to, to simulate driving tanks, flying helicopters, and so we use the HMDs to really get that immersive, immersive experience, uh, like you're flying a real helicopter, but that you can't really get anywhere else. I see the future of simulation training becoming more and more dependent upon HMDs, like the Barrio primarily because it provides a very cost-effective solution that allows for a smaller footprint and a solution that can be deployed anywhere in the world.